Okay, now, we have a number of companies, including one that just came public recently called Toast. We've got a company called Lightspeed. These are, in the com these are companies that do point of sale. Uh, I'm trying to figure out where your company fits in in terms of point of sale. Are you reselling uh, uh, Clover? Is that the one that you represent? You know, Clover is a terrific device, but we actually represent different devices. What we, what we offer is a comprehensive solution for small business. So for example, we have a scaled HR and payroll solution that really targets the low end of the market that isn't occupied or isn't chased very hard by the biggest players. We now combine that with the credit card acceptance from First American by Deluxe, and we have a really compelling offer for small businesses. It's a giant market, as you well know, Jim, with great secular growth trends, and First American is really well positioned in a variety of segments, and uh, we are, we're leveraging those for growth already. So if everything goes right, say, this time next year, will you expect accelerated revenue growth from your business? We do. And, you know, here's the simple envelope math, Jim, on the First American acquisition. Deluxe supports about 4 million small businesses. First American has about 150,000 small businesses. First American has about 120 or 130 bank partners. Deluxe has about 4,000 bank partners. So if we're just a little bit successful at bringing the first American suite of solutions to our existing customer base, we have an opportunity to help that business grow remarkably. At the same time, checks never really went away, right? There are many uses for checks that, that people like that have, that have advantages over credit cards. You know what, I think you're right, but I, we, we have never said the checks are a growth business, but checks are sure a great cash flow generating machine. And the durability of that cash flow through the COVID crisis proved itself to be true. We've also been able to grow market share in the check business, which has helped slow that secular decline for our business. And actually in the second quarter of this year, we posted growth in the check business. But you're absolutely right that the use cases for check, especially around business to business payments, there are no viable substitutes. So those checks are gonna be around for a very long time, which is great news for cash flow generation for deluxe and for deluxe shareholders. Well, well I look forward to seeing uh, all these businesses uh, have more cash flow and uh, growth rate accel growth accelerate, because I do think that your stock at 1.6 billion uh, in market cap is an oddity, let's say, versus what you just paid for a very good company. I wanna thank uh, Barry McCarthy, President and CEO of Deluxe. Good to see you, sir. Don't miss a second of Mad Money. Follow at Jim Kramer on Twitter. Have a question? Tweet Kramer. Hashtag Mad Tweets. Send Jim an email to madmoney at CNBC.com or give us a call at 1 800 743 CNBC. Miss something? Head to madmoney.cnbc.com.